I'm an artist working and living in Dundee, Scotland. In terms of the studio practice, um, I treat the studio as a place where I can experiment. Um, I sort of subscribe to the idea that the studio is a laboratory where you can play with ideas. But at least like if you if you have a great idea and you're in the studio then it means that you can run with it while you're here. Um, it can be a place that's quiet, sort of not a sanctuary but somewhere that can be very relaxing, but at the same time uh, it's where you have to grapple with what you're doing. So it can be a very frustrating place to be, but if I wasn't here I don't know <laughs> where else I would deal or uh, experiment and grapple with these ideas. There's always continuing threads between what you do, even if you don't realise it at the time. You know, there's certainly, you develop a visual language throughout any medium. Um, I know, for me, there's certain images or symbols or things that I might use, even subconsciously sometimes, that are repeated in future work. Um, and that's interesting to examine in itself. Self-examination is a big part of what I'm trying to do, what I now want to, to move on to. Theme-wise, at the moment I'm quite interested in quite sort of love, loss, life, death, universal things that affect all of us. Um, and to some degree looking at more specifically ideas of identity, what the notion of an individual identity is uh, and just the human condition, that's the kind of thing that, that interests me, the idea that you know, fundamentally we're animals even if we don't really want to be considered as such or if we don't think of ourselves as just being another part of the food chain. Um, you know, the thin veil Civility and humanity over you know, the violence that is inherent within us all is that's interesting to me. I'm not trying to convey some sort of, or set myself up as like a moral arbiter for any of these any of these topics. You know, all I'm trying to do is convey my perception of the world through the lens of my art, and then spit it back out again. What people choose to take from it, uh, what moral stance, whatever, that's fine by me. Once the artwork leaves the studio, uh, it takes on its own life, uh, and that's an interesting part. trying to be 
specific about the ambiguity of what it is to be a human being, you know, in the work. Um, that's where I'm trying to go.